The Steinberg CMC FD fader controller is a compact USB bus powered touch capacitance fader controller for programs like Cubase and Nuendo. Up to four units can be stacked together yielding up to 16 channels of tactile control. One of the things that's always difficult with many fader controllers is to actually see what channels are indeed selected. We can look right over here on our little white strip and we could see that these channels are selected versus other channels. If I wanted to go into my mixer view, we could look at and see our four channels are selected here. Hitting my next channel or previous channel button would allow me to change what channels are being controlled by the FD unit. We'll also have bank, so I could go by intervals of four, eight, 12 or 16, depending on how many CMC FD fader controls are indeed connected to the system. Now the faders themselves will actually work in two different modes. One will be jump mode and the other will be catch. So the default mode will be catch. If I place my finger below the current value, it will not engage the fader until my finger gets to that value and then we'll have full tactile control. To switch to jump mode, simply hold down shift plus the previous bank button. And now anywhere that you tap, the faders will automatically go to that value. To toggle back to catch mode, again, shift plus previous bank button. If I wanted to go to the first selected channel, such as my bass track, I can hold down shift plus my previous channel button. And they'll follow consecutively. Our faders are incredibly responsive as you see. So we'll come right over here. We can also have a higher level of responsiveness by going into our fine fader mode. And I do this by holding down shift plus moving my finger on the fader and we get 800% the resolution. If I wanted to be normal resolution, release the shift key, fine resolution, come right there. Now we can also do some interesting things with solos and mutes. And if I wanted to solo a particular channel, I could hold down the shift key and click in the bottom area. That will solo the track. If I wanted to hold down shift key plus click in the bottom area again, that will unsolo the track. Or if I wanted to mute, I hold down shift plus tap in the upper area. Now one of the other things that's very handy is the ability not only of these touch capacitance screens to work as faders, but to have them work as meters. So coming here, holding down shift plus my next channel button, I can now see my meters for all of my channels. So as you can see, using the Steinberg CMC FD fader controller with up to 16 channels of controls significantly improves your workflow with programs like Cubase and Nuendo.